The local berry farms have been open and the strawberries have been ripe for picking. They're so sweet and juicy. One of the desserts I like to make with fresh strawberries is to stuff them and just make a little something sweet that takes just one or two bites. These are delicious. And of course, I start with nice, fresh, ripe strawberries. And then to stuff them, I've got two things. One is little chunks of pound cake that I'm going to put into the strawberries first. Now you can buy the frozen pound cake. You can make your own. Today I'm using a Scandinavian almond cake that I baked. But just use any cake that's nice and um, heavy and dense, similar to a pound cake. And now I'm going to make a cream cheese filling. I've got three ounces of softened cream cheese in my bowl. I'm going to beat it up till it's nice and creamy, and then I'll add a couple more things. When the cream cheese is nice and creamy, add some orange zest. Now remember the zest is just the colored part of the citrus peel. And I've got my grater zester that I'm using. It's a great handy tool to have in your kitchen because you'll be using it for more than just zesting citrus peel. I like to do the whole orange, depending on the size of the orange, but you just want to get a nice orange flavor when you bite into the strawberries. It's a great flavor combination. And then I've also toasted a quarter cup of slivered almonds and then I ground them up. If you don't have a food processor, you can just use your sh uh, sharp chef's knife and chop them up real, real fine. And then just mix it all up. There, so we've got our fillings ready to go. Now all we need to do is stuff the strawberries. I've got some nice strawberries here. The larger the strawberries, the easier this job is to do. I'm just cutting off the stem end to make a nice flat, flat end of the strawberry so that I can easily cut four slits, just kind of an X into the end of the strawberry, and then take a tiny chunk of pound cake, stick it into the middle. Now, the creamy mixture can be put into a piping bag, a pastry bag, or you can put it into a plastic bag, cut the tip off. I'm using a metal tip on this, and I'm just going to pipe this filling right over the top of the strawberry to cover up the, cheese, or the pound cake that's in the middle. Cheesecake would be good, too. And there you go, it is so sweet. And you can make up a nice little plate of these stuffed strawberries, one or two bites for something sweet. Your guests will love it, so will your family. They're a great way to enjoy the fresh strawberries of the season. I'm Sue Doden, and I'm all about food.